Sierra. When I started to think about these vows and how to formulate what I wanted to say, I really didn't know where to start. You know me, my mind goes a thousand miles per hour and I struggle to translate those into thoughts. When I think back to the start, I think of the first time meeting you and how our relationship transpired over those next years. It took me a while to realize it, but you were truly what I needed in my life. I know for a fact that God put you in my life for a reason. I'm honestly so excited for you to become my wife. I know you're gonna look absolutely beautiful and I can't wait to see you walk down the aisle. Let's have fun today and celebrate us. I love you. David, I can't believe our wedding day is finally here. Today we become one, husband and wife. I used to think that we met by chance because it was raining and I needed a place to dry off. But now I know without a doubt that God put you in front of me because we were meant to spend the rest of our lives together. You give my stomach butterflies when I see you, whether it's for the first time. <laughs> In days, weeks, and months. My heart beats slower and faster at the same time. You're my favorite person, my shoulder to cry on, my number one cheerleader, and most importantly, my best friend. Falling for you and saying yes to marrying you was the easiest decision of my life. From this day forward, we are a team, husband and wife. I love you, David Buco. Man. Seeing you today for the first time in your dress and walking you down the aisle, the emotions were unbelievable. Oh boy. Oh, we're both laughing, but I'm about to get serious. Woo! You look amazing. Thank you. Got me shaking. To the first man I ever loved, I'll always love you. I've known Sierra for about 25 years, and she's my favorite granddaughter, and I've loved her for almost 25 years. David, not so. It's only been three or four. And once he called me Papa, I knew he was okay. And I love him very much too. If you've ever been at a Lefevre gathering of any sort, where two or three Lefevres gather, there's bound to be a card playing breaking out sooner or later. Card playing has a lot to do with marriage because we don't always get the greatest cards. That means that we don't give up over one hand. That means in marriage, you don't give up just because sometimes you get dealt a lousy hand. Just as marriage does not happen in a single moment, you are beginning this process of consent before this community, but marriage is a long, long journey, which means there's going to be lots of hands, good and bad, ups and downs, but don't take it out on the partner. At worst, take it out on the cards. I, David, take you, Sierra. To be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. Sierra, receive this ring. As a sign of my love. And fidelity. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. Amen. It is now my privilege and my pleasure to introduce to you David and Sierra Buco. My name is Joseph. I'm the brother and best man of David. So I want to start with the exercise. Sierra, place your hand on the table, and David, place your hand on top of hers. That right there is the last time you'll have the upper hand. Um, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Balin. I've been one of Sierra's best friends for, what, almost 20 years now? Can we just take a second to look at how absolutely stunning and beautiful that David looks tonight? Just... And I said, ooh, ooh, what would you do if you could lose all your burdens, yeah? Yeah, 
everyone, I'm Hannah, and I've been pretty blessed to be your younger sister, especially because not only do I get to call you my sister, but now I get to call you my best friend. Um, you are honestly the one I trust the most. I know mom hates it because I don't go to her first all the time anymore, but I love that I can go to you for everything. Is Snapchat still a happening thing? Yes. Is it? So what I don't get is then you, when that friend sees that video, that video disappears. It's gone. So when I look around this room, I see friends, neighbors, family, great aunts, great uncles, parents, grandparents and my advice to you David and Sierra is don't make these people one-time snaps there's a lot of knowledge and experience in this room and I'd like to thank my wife of 27 years we wouldn't have gotten this far without each other and you can do it too you've got a great start on a great marriage have fun <laughs> 